So I just finished doing my washes, right? I saw the shower cap from one of the hotels we laid over at. Um, Cause I thought I was gonna deep condition my hair while I was there, but I ended up didn't. But I'm gonna, the deep conditioner I'm gonna use today is the Rucker Roots. Um, I don't know if I told you this, but whenever we went to Charlotte, we went into the Midtown Mall or the mall in Midtown, I don't know. But, and I'm uh, this, they had like a little uh, shop set up. I got some edge control from here. And she gave me a free Nourish Restore Papaya and Mango Deep Conditioning Mask. So can you see? Don't blur it out. Rucker Roots, I really like the edge control. What I will say is that it doesn't hold. It doesn't give you like, you know, just because being natural is the whole thing. But, so, let's see. Let me put my glasses on so I can. Cause I can read, but like, I just feel like I would see better with my glasses. So it says, after shampooing, apply a generous amount. Nicholas uh, took to the scalp it into the hair, comb through, distribute, sit under warm dryer or steam. Place the cap, sit under warm dryer, may leave hair for 30 minutes or overnight without heat, necessarily as usual. Okay, so we are gonna use a shower cap. Here it is, shower cap. But I'm about to empty the contents. Let me back y'all up so y'all can see. Marley! Marley is over there playing, and I don't know, I don't got time for it. But anyways, so we are going to. Let me pop a squat. So y'all can see me in the mixture a little bit. So, okay, let's smell. And we're just gonna leave it on for as long as it takes me to do my other self care stuff. So, 30 minutes to an hour, probably. If that. So, squeeze it all out. Let's see what other products it has in there. Hold on. Yeah. I used to go because I really I hate the feel of wet hair. I don't know if I told you that, but know that. Papaya seed oil, mango butter, and avocado oil. So oh yeah, now you really smell it. I smell the mango butter. It smells good. Then I take some Jamaican black castor oil. Um I didn't have a lot left in here. Cause I packed up the rest so that I could have it on my travels so we just about to pour all this in there leave about a couple of drops for the hairstyle after it um i was gonna use my hand but the way that that set up i don't use my hand just yet because i'm about to comb through Okay, so it basically just looks like this. Jamaican black castor oil, this color takes over basically anything it touches. Looks pretty. Looks like mango butter. All right, let's get started. I'm done chatting. Hey, 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 hey. Fast for a day, dreaming about the next 
time And it's gon' happen again Cause I just wanna have fun Come and beat me up Meet me at the spot Up all night Till the sun rise Pop back cool Get ready for the ride Don't it feel good? Don't it feel good? Don't it feel good? Don't it feel good? How you feel? Turn it up a notch Pop out clean room Everyday celebration Take a trip vacation You deserve a day You deserve a day off Parking for too long Gotta keep back Tell myself Okay, so I had a hole I got a hole in my other shower cap So I just Doubled up With a Grocery bag Because That comes In handy And we all have those everywhere Because I just did not feel like Digging out Another shower cap So Now I'm about to do My Um Facial method down plan. I'm supposed to get my eyebrows done tomorrow. I rescheduled it so many times, but finally, um, I have a time that I think that I will have slowed down my life. Hopefully, fingers crossed. But I'm about to clean my ears. If y'all know anything about me, I think I've been saying that a lot here lately, but I really love to um, clean my ears and my earrings. Um, Cause these second holes, I never really take these out unless I'm cleaning them. They stay in 24-7. So I just clean them back home. Because, and I don't like when my, you know, like the back of your ears, you know, you could get a scent. I don't even have time to get that. I don't even want that scent to ever come about. So I just prefer to keep my ears clean. And so like that. Ooh, girl. I didn't even put tissue in the sink to like to stop it because my clumpy is be done. Drop the um a back or a, the earring itself in the sink. I'm gonna charge these batteries tonight so that they're fully charged tomorrow. I think I pretty much have everything. I was just gonna say uh, what. Stroke, <laughs> but I think these are my second holes. Girl, you can't really see unless how small they are. Shut up. Okay, let me clean my ear. I'll put them back. But I think I pretty much have everything set up and organized for my whole little life. I did order some new uniforms. My battery, um. I got my battery. My phone kept saying that the storage was full. So after I showed y'all them shoes from Fashion Nova, my, it was just downhill from there. And my, my actual camera was in the car. It was just a lot, a lot going on. In that little time span. But y'all see when I actually wear the items. Uh -oh. I don't want to dermal plan my sideburns too high. So I'll be trying to hide the hair away from me. Because if I see it while I'm dermal planning, it's like the tendon, like the saddest, the satisfaction. It's like, oh my God, just do it. It's going to be so satisfying once it's, you have it in the, uh, you have it off. And to see all of the hair, that's so weird. I don't know why that's a thing for me, but that's a thing. We need to invent something that makes it easier to clean your ears. Is there something that is easier for people to clean their ears? Like a little bowl, like a little witty witty bowl for people to clean their ears, soak their earrings, make this process like a one step process opposed to like a two, three, four process. That means dermal plan, steam, wash, and put a mask on. Then after I rinse the mask off, that's when I'm going to rinse my hair out. And then I think I'm just going to flat twist it down, leave that in for majority of the day until it's time to uh, 
to actually do my hair, then take it down so it'll be a nice little fresh twist out. That's what I'm thinking. Because I love a fresh twist out. Y'all know I do like second day hair, but I also like, um, I also like, A nice moisturized hair. So if I leave it in for the majority of the time, why does that ear hole look like that? I feel like when I got this second hole pierced on this side, it is completely like it does something weird. Like it, like I don't think it's he did it right. I don't think he centered it right because it's uneven. Mm. I don't know how I feel about that. Like it just does not look even. It looks like it's more on the side of my ear more than it is in the center of my ear. Does that make sense? So it's more like on the side of the lobe opposed to on the lobe. Girl, whatever. Because clearly I agree to the dot or marker or whatever he put. I didn't, when did I get these second holes? I think I got these. Hmm. I got these second holes. Um, I got these second holes. Hmm, in college? Maybe. I don't know. But y'all know that all of my piercings that I have had, all of my piercings that I have had outside of my um, second hole and my first hole, I don't have any of. I don't have them anymore. My tray gets pierced with one of my high school uh, close friends. Um, it was like real early, crazy. Um, yeah, I thought I was underage drinking. Mm -hmm. But I do not. Hmm. Hmm. Oh. Had to be. But what? I remember. I was definitely sixteen. Yeah. Anyways, but now I don't have that piercing anymore because, you know, that had to come out. Or I could have got a like a stud to go in there, but I was like, just take it out. I don't really care. And then my nose piercing. I really love that nose piercing. That is not here anymore. I really love that. Um. But y'all know that I'm very keloid prone. Clearly. Um, I'm very key. Look, these are the scissors I was talking about to get my um to trim up the crew tags. But anyways, what was I saying? I'm very keloid prone. Um, I'm very keloid prone. And girl, what was I saying? I'm very keloid prone. Oh yeah, my nose. So it kept trying to keloid, but it it. It's, it was my fault. The nose ring was all my fault. Um, and it just never properly healed. So it will always like call some type of trauma or some type of like, um, uh, like trauma bump. And then I'll have to put ointment on it. I just had to go through a whole cycle. I ain't was there no more. Um, and I didn't want to get a stud because I really enjoyed the hoop. So I was just like, forget about that one too. I did have the industrial bar. I got that. That was my very first piercing. My mama took me to go get that. Um, I had that. I think I was like, I think I was 16, 15 or 16. And my mama took me. I like bled everywhere. That tried to keloid. Um, I took that out once I got to college because it just, I would, I was, you know, natural. And then just putting more products on my hair and it not properly, I guess, having the time to heal while I'm putting products, washing my hair every week. It was just a mess. Um, I love that piercing so much, but that had to go once I got to college because it just, the keloiding process, I wasn't near my home doctor, so it was just like something I just didn't want to deal with. I still have like the little keloid bumps on the, I know the back of my ear for sure. I think on a little bit on the top. Um, what other piercings have I had? Mm, nose, tragus, second hole, first hole, industrial bar. That's it. I haven't had my cartilage pierced. I don't have a belly pierced. I don't have none. No, no. That's it. 
I'm not a, um, you know, I'm no, I'm staying away from piercings. After my nose piercing situation, I'm staying away from them. I'm good. Don't need no more. I don't want any more. <laughs> She want me to lock it down, but I told her to pass the key You gotta slow it down, girl, you moving too fast for me Nobody did it like this, so they wonder, they asking me If I can slow it down, cause it's coming too fast for me Baby, don't try it, just stop it You should know that I got options I be fly like I live in the cockpit Mess around with the money, get drop kick. Only one in the city to pop quick Never cared about being your top ten Y'all, my hair Oh my god, it's pillow soft Pillow, let me, I don't think y'all understand. Oh my God, it is pillow soft. It feels so amazing. Oh my gosh. It feels like a cloud. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna have to go and order me some of that, y'all. And I literally just focus on like my roots and my ends. But I still, you know, put it on like, you know, the shaft in my hair, but definitely focus on the roots and my ends. Oh, my hair feels amazing. It smells amazing. You know, Jamaican black castor or got a distinct smell, but it feels good. I just wanted to tell y'all that it's now like midnight. I'm finally about to do my hair. I've done everything. <sighs> I've exfoliated and everything. Mask was great, lovely. I have that ointment that I was telling y'all about when I got my nose piercing. Cause the lump look a little big or maybe I spoke it up. I don't know, but we, we're gonna take it away. But yes, I'm tired. AF, but I gotta, I gotta do my hair. So I don't have to worry about this tomorrow. And then tomorrow should be smooth, smooth sailing. Um, I'm watching the Upshaws. I really have been enjoying this. And I like to binge watch it. So I wait until like there's a whole season or, or a whole, like a bunch of episodes more than like eight episodes multiple seasons honestly because i like to binge watch stuff so yep that is it for tonight for real i'm not picking up back up no more tonight see y'all in the morning good morning everybody it, it, ew i hate when she rubs up against me when i have all like greasy oil because it kind of sticks anyway but it is happy saturday it is Where's my phone? It is 10.32 and, hold on. Hello, oh, that's the ringer. It is 10.32 a.m. I'm up, I am showered and stuff. Now we have to go run these errands because they ain't gonna run themselves. I need to go to the post office to make a return for some of that Fashion Nova stuff. I need to go to the mall, Belk, JCPenney's, specifically so i'll probably just go like drive into like where their parking lot is and then um go into the store and then come out and go to the next one my hair is flat twisted i just have it um in a bun so that it stays extended what else so we go to the post office post office belk jc penny stop Belk, look at her. Where is she? Where are you at? Belk, JC Penny. Um, Target. One more time, cause I got a, a gift card, so I want to use it again. Um, she's doing it on purpose. Um, and then I want to be done by two, so I can come back and shower again, so that I can do my makeup, and my hair. Um, and then I'm going to meet my sister at my parents' house because they, um, we're going to like take, my sister never went to prom. So this is her, she's like, we're going to do this like prom. And I'm like, okay, girl, I went to prom, but I'm going to let you have this. Okay. So we're going to have like a little prom session. Her and her guy are going to come. I think he's going to meet us there. I don't know. We'll see. But yeah, let's just bust down these errands. I did. I packed. Oh, I gotta get my car service at twelve thirty. So that's why I'm trying to go to the do the mall things and post office before that because after that 
don't know how long it's going to take. I'm giving them an hour max to service my car because it's just a regular routine service. Just fill me up, rotate me out, and let me go. Um, but I did pack my laptop um, and I'm packing my camera equipment so that I can kind of edit while I'm there so I can be productive, multitask. Um, so, yeah, let's get out of here because I hate being on a time crunch. I love being on time and I hate when I'm late to stuff. And I don't want to rush my makeup or hair. So, even though we're not doing a lot, I just don't like to rush. I don't like to sweat when I'm getting ready for something. So, let's go. I need to put some gloss on. I got chapstick, but... It ain't doing what I need it to do. So let's, let me find some lip gloss, step one. Find something to put on your lips, Sarah. I got a bag of change in here that I need to um, turn into somebody's, what's the name? What is it called? To, what, I need to turn into somebody's, um, coin machine so I can get the money. Oh, and then I also, I wanted to go to Play-Dohs. I think I'm about to go, where I'm going right now. Jesse, see who needs them? I'm about to drop this off at Play-Dohs. Oh, my zooming in. What is happening? How do I do, how did I do that? I'm trying to do things with one hand. Okay, y'all, let me go. So I can be done on time. Okay, y'all, so I, I'm, I'm about to get, it's about to get real, real wild out here in these streets. So I'm at McDonald's, right? I got a little story time, mini story time. So I'm at McDonald's because I don't went to the post office. I don't return. I went to Bill, did my return. JT did my return. No problem. I've been patient. I've been patient, but I think it's because I'm getting a little hungry. So I go to the bank because my bank was right beside the post office. Am I recording? Okay, so my bank is right beside the post office, so I get a 20 out. The, the bank, most ATMs that I like the, for my bank, they tell me like set bill amount. This sent, or set bill mix. This didn't ask me, so I was like, cool, I'm hungry. I'm gonna just spend a little $5 out of the 20 because I need ones because when we um, get picked up from like, you know, the car service or limo service, we tip. And typically, with somebody I didn't know, we tip it and we tip ones, right? So I was like, I'm just, you know, I sent 425, right? So, um, 425, right? So my order was, I meant, no, my order was 425. I had 25 cents and I had a, the $20 bill. I give this man $20.25. This man gives me $6 back. He says, You only gave me 10. Sir, 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 sir. Sir, I were I can pull up the receipt. I just went to the bank. I just got twenty dollars. I just gave you that twenty dollars. I don't even have a ten dollar bill. I don't have any other cash but that twenty dollar bill. He's talking about well, I'll need to recount my drawer. That's what you're gonna have to do because you're not about to rob me in my face. Okay? As a corporation, you're not about to rob me in my face. Give me my other money back. Let me do the math so that just to be sure, if I gave twenty dollars, if it Twenty dollars. I get twenty five minus four twenty five. He need to give me back sixteen dollars. You're missing a ten because that's what you owe me, sir. You owe me the ten, and I asked him to put it in all ones, and he gave me six ones. And I said, how much was it? He said four twenty five. I s and he said I gave you six. I gave you a twenty. What are you talking about? He said, well, I only have a ten in my drawer. I just got that. You need to recount your drawer. Somebody need to give me my money. My money. That I just got out of my bank that I worked for. Somebody need to give it back. You're not about to rob me in my face like that. Not on my watch. I don't care how long it takes. I don't care who you got to talk to. Somebody is giving me my remaining $10 in ones. Like, or just give me my whole order back. I'll give you the food back. Because at this point, I done got frustrated, y'all. Because he literally just looked at me in my face and told him I gave him a $10 bill. When I literally just went to the bank and got a $20 out. Is there a timestamp on here? Because it is 11.46. Literally, down the street. You're going to have to run me my money. I didn't give you no $10. I didn't give you $10, sir. Somebody going to have to run me my money. 
you're not about to rob me in my face like this when I know what I gave you you know what I'm saying and that's what's so crazy to me is like when you know what you give somebody I have to get my car service this not about to push me back so I'm gonna give them to 1205 because I've been sitting here for a good five minutes already it's 1203 it's 1204 I will go in there and I'm not I'm not causing havoc don't get the wrong impression but I will I need answers okay I need a solution I need answers I need a solution I need answers I need my money that's the only solution the only solution and I need answers as to why you would sit up here and tell me what I gave you when I know what I gave you I should have knew it was a red flag when he was like I got the people talking to my ear and I don't want to confuse you so I don't want to confuse them I should have knew that just aggravated me and I think it's just my period because it's like how are you gonna sit here and tell me what I just gave you they took my receipt so mm -mm. Mm -mm. but that didn't make me feel too good that they out here or he is out here let me not speak for the company that he is out here robbing people in their face uh-uh. They don't sit well with me. But I just wanted to tell you all that really quick. Because I'm about to go in here. Mm-mm. I don't like that. I need to get my car service. I'm going to get there exactly on time. I have somewhere to be. <sighs> Calm down. I'm trying to give them time and be patient. And not be pushy. But... So he literally... I cannot... I'm in disbelief that he sat there and told me I gave him a $10 bill. He said, it's the only 10 in my drawer. I don't care what's the only 10 in your drawer. I didn't give you $10. I don't even have a $10 bill. I don't have a $1 bill. All I have is this 20. Mm-mm. That saddens me. That he, like, if you don't pay attention, if you don't pay attention for real, you could really get ripped off. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. And I was paying attention because I need the one. So I'm like, you only give me six. Hey, do you have ones? Can I have ones and all ones? You want just the ones? Yeah, ten ones. Tell me that. Bye. How dare they? Another guy just came out here and he said, sorry. Yeah, recount that drawer. Mm. Mm. Let me eat so I can come down. Bring my energy all the way back down so that my day is not thrown off. Let me get down, Sarah. Have to count the five. Okay, y'all. I guess I'm gonna see y'all at the dealership when I'm actually been more productive than this. I've been on the road, I've been doing shows. Now we ain't steak, remember sleeping on the floor. We're still in at the gas station when the time was cold. In the kitchen, hostel, trying to flip it off the stove. Rocking fake J's, praying that nobody know. Watch them take my dog away, it was way too hard to stay composed. Fight to see the light of day, all this blood on my clothes. I was tired every day, green light, it's time to go. I don't wanna live life fast or die too young. Die too young. 100 miles per hour. It's been a while, but I, I'm done getting my car service. She calling me or not? What's happening with my phone? Let's see. Is the volume on? Okay, so she's not answering. Anyways, I'm about to do like a little bit of makeup. I'm not doing a lot because my hair is gonna be really what I'm worried about. I mean, my skin has to breathe because it's breaking out a little bit. So I think I'm gonna do a little concealer. Um, a little concealer. Let me, let me see. I can fit on 
these Clorox wipes. Oh, perfect. Should I put it? Don't fall. Okay, so I think I'm just gonna do like a little concealer. Um, set it and keep it pushing. You know what I'm saying? I'm not really here to enter mascara because it is something I haven't worn mascara in a long time. One, because it takes a long time to get the mascara. Um, takes a really long time for the mascara to my phone is ringing again so now I feel like a chicken with my head cut off it's like I feel like I don't know what I want to do what I want to do first this is a butter gloss this literally looks exactly this is um bit of honey by NYX Oh, it wants to be. It made my lips tingle. I think it's expired. Because my red, my red lipstick, but are my red butter gloss from NYX that I got at the exact same time doesn't make my lips tingle. This is NYX. Oh, girl. What does it say? Red Heart. Wait. And this is NYX Butter Gloss as well. It don't make my lips tingle. Not like this one does. Could be because I put on a lot. I mean, my lips look real nude. I don't know how I feel about that. This is my favorite uh, wand. I really like the wand on this. Lips, lip look. It's a Rihanna Fenty. This is in slippery uh, glass slipper. This is in glass slipper. I love the wand on it. It's almost gone. So we just gonna mess up the wand. Anyways, let me finish getting dressed. Or not getting dressed. Let me do my makeup and I'll come back and show y'all what I did. Okay, y'all. So I have finished with a little bit of makeup that I put on. <laughs> um, now I'm taking my twist down. Um, I'm gonna fluff the roots of my hair to give it a little bit more um, definition. Oh my gosh, people keep calling me. Leave me alone. Smells. Okay, so should I do down the middle? You know it's gonna get on my nerves. Let's see. It's going to This is like the natural light from the window. That gives the big, because I wanted my hair to kind of be the thing. You know what I'm saying? I don't want to have to wear a necklace or anything. Or should I pin it up? I don't know. But I decided once I put my dress on at my parents' house. I'm not deciding right now because we only have pieces of the look together. Um, y'all yeah. yeah. all right i'll pick it up whenever i'm dressed and stuff i'm going to do it i'm going to be vlogging on my phone or my instagram story i'll insert clips in there because this camera has too many components to carry around and i don't want to do that i'm gonna be honest with you i just don't want to carry it around um yeah or i don't want to leave it in the car either i don't want to leave it at the table so we're gonna get the vibes caught they're just gonna be in a different quality. So yeah. You, you on my mind a lot.
Don't need no time, watch. I don't know how I got you in my pocket spot. Yeah, this bay, miss you every day. You like my oxygen. Make it seem like the barge in them. Got my heart, no barge in From the bed to the flow to the couch. Might wake the neighbors up. Break you in, then break you out. In the end, we gon' make a chat. Then we gon' hit the show. Part two, we don't need no pause. It is so nice uh, to see you here, and we appreciate you joining us tonight in support of Girl Talk, a truly incredible organization. Now, I have the honor of presenting an award with you on how Girl Talk continues to impact lives. Please turn your attention to the screens. Dreamed of and from just a moment from the beginning of the storm to the end the movie went from black and white to color. The storm took that child from having a black and white life to color. You have taken people in this community and in this city from a black and white life and you, and you put them in color. Yeah. Okay, so it's after the party, the after party. We at Waffle House. Live and in effect. Okay, how do you feel? How do you feel, Michelle? Amazing. Gala, we attending events. It was like a prom. We networking. It was. I told you my sister never been to a prom, and you know, we gonna always let her have these moments. Um. Okay. The Waffle House always got something going on. We gotta watch our back, our fronts, our sides. Our cuticles, <laughs> all of that. Anyways, um, but you feel good? Mm -hmm. I'm sitting on the edge of the car because her dress is big. Um, Gala, we networking, okay? We making connections. I've seen, I've seen so many people um, that I ain't seen in a really long time. Glad that I've seen them. Um, popped in, popped out. <laughs> Anyways, I'm glad to be back. I'm glad this is the first, basically the first full day that we got to reunite. That's fine. I've been gone. What did you drink, girl? Let listen to what the heck, the heck this girl ordered for her first drink. What did you order? Um, whiskey. A Jim Bean and a Pepsi. Oh, it was straight to the point. Who the heck drinks that? And I hated my hair today, my jaw, but. It is what it is. We took. Oh my God! We took this cute picture. She showed them the cute picture. She all got a lot of pictures. Hold on. <laughs> Look, we took this cute picture. Show this is a really nice color on you. What green? Uh, did no this green though. This is like a um. Hmm. It's not olive green. It's like a, um, I don't know, but I like this color. It's still dark. I try to turn on the lights, but we are picking up my niece from my parents' house. Hello, Felicia. Oh, grumpy, yeah. Hi, mama. Picking up my niece. I had the time. We ate so well. I well, I didn't even eat all my food, but it was fun. I ended up pinning my hair up, so it was up for majority. I'm gonna try to put in. Look, mama. Let me get I will. Oh, the windshield wiper scared me. I won't wear shorts. Hello, Felicia. What'd you have to say? What's up, Papa? Mama? No, <laughs> your mama's sitting in the corner. No, Hi, what's up, Papa Mama? <laughs> mm. What y'all been up to? Nothing. 
Mama, did you want to go to the movies tomorrow? I'll ask you tomorrow after church. She don't get in the back seat. I know. Because it's some condensation or something that's that she, she don't go get the back for your mama and close my door for somebody to take it off the hinges. I don't care. You're gonna care. I'm going to care about your booty. <laughs>